Hello, Edgar. My name is Rolando Espinoza, and I'm with Zucor Marketing. Thanks for taking the time to talk to Eric earlier. And as promised, here's your website analysis. You have a really nice website, really dynamic images, uh, good pictures, um, services, a call to action to get a free estimate there. Very nice uh, layout. You have a map, way to contact you. All your information is here. So there's a lot of things uh, going well for the website, but I want to talk to you a little bit about um, how to rank better in a Google search. Um, that is something that uh, will reflect in traffic for the website and definitely will translate into uh, ultimately into more customers. So one of the things that Google takes into consideration and it's very important for them is content. They want to see 1500 or more words on your homepage and and let's check out I don't think you have that amount here let me try to let you guys select everything here this is an image okay so that's the content and if we go here to the world count let me clear this and paste the content on your homepage you have 742 words it's not bad but you're still short of the 1500 that that Google wants to see the moment that you have that amount of content that more you look like a trustworthy provider in the service that you were offering in your area so that is number one something right off the bat that you can do is to add more content now not not all content is the same uh, something that also Google takes in consideration is keywords keywords are phrases that people are typing when they are searching for services like the ones that you provide in your area you have different services but i'm going to concentrate in roofing um, because that or roofers that which is one of the services more important in that listed in the, the kind of services that you do so if i google roofers richmond virginia this is the results that i get of course the first ones are the uh, paid uh, so this is a google ads many people ignore those um, and they are randomly appear everybody that pays for it they're going to appear randomly in in different searches that you do so skipping that part we go to another very important part of the result which is immediately after the paid advertisement is the what we call the map pack in the map pack these people get a lot of traffic they get a lot of attention the map pack gives you like immediately there you can have the phone number People again can call directly to that go directly to your website they see if you're open at the moment um, so being in the map pack is something that you want to to achieve because that's going to reflect into a lot of traffic how can you get to the map pack what you need to do is if you already don't have one is to have a google business profile and what you're going to do is you're going to add as much information as possible the name of your company website email address physical address if you have different uh, places you have all the addresses phone number hours of operation pictures as much information as you can put into that google business profile the better chances are to to rank in the mac pack now in order to beat this three competitors that you have here what you need to do is that same information that you have on the google business profile you want to add it in as many as possible relevant directories like i'm talking about yelp gaff uh, better business bureau yellow pages yahoo all of those directories if you want to add that same information that you have on your google business profile and that's the way to get into the mac pack now the next part that you get is what we call the organics these are non-paid results this is just uh, by um, reputation that you have google gives uh, rank this because they trust their trustworthy uh, providers and there's an opportunity here because nobody no no business is reaching here number one is not it's not coming up those these are lists and you know this is yelp and this is the first actual provider and what is this person doing what is this company doing uh richmond va roofing what are they doing differently and what you can do to beat them like i said there's nobody claiming the number one spot organically many many times you can achieve this um, and let me tell you how how this is done so this is your website and i'm going to open ahrefs which is um, a paid service that we have to look in the back end of the website and we're gonna uh, concentrate in a couple of different numbers so we have here what is called the dr and the ur the dr is how much google trust your website 
n you have zero there on the on the dr and the ur is the strength of that website and it's also a very low number how can you bump up those and let me compare this is the other website that is ranking number one they have a, a very decent website not not much it's not uh, super impressive but they are ranking high what is it that they're doing let me show you here in the overview for them the dr for them is 30 the ur is 12 and this takes me to the third part of what i wanted to talk to you is about the backlinks a backlink is basically a shout out from another website let's say that you don't have a directory with yelp and you add your link a link to your website to Yelp to that directory that is a backlink so this company what they have is 542 backlinks which are 87 referring domains um, that is what it's that's why they are ranking them. these are not like super impressive numbers but because there are not many in your area that's why they are ranking high you can see here they are non-paid traffic all of this is organic um, so what they are doing is having good backlinks and keywords so those are the, the the three things that you want to concentrate here if we look at the organic keywords this is their website and this is the the traffic that those keywords are reflected into so they have richmond virginia roofing it's 300 hits per month roofing richmond 350 Rich, roofing richmond va 350 richmond roof 150 roofers richmond va 350 so all of this is this the amount of hits per month that does keywords if you add those keywords to your content this is the amount of hits that they are that they are getting so that is one of the reasons now the other one is the referring domains uh, what i was telling you about so this is mapquest and this is the rating of that of this uh, uh of this uh backlink or refer domain mapquest chrome page expertise yellow pages super pages all of this is the ones that you want to add a link to your website because these have good ratings of course that you go down the list this they start not to be as good like this are the, the send to the second page all of these are not as relevant they have zero rating so but you want to concentrate on this part of the backlinks that they have and added your page to all of this like they did so to put it all together um and what I wanted to talk to you about is the, the, those three things to put it all together is content, the amount of content, 1500 or more words, but quality content that will have those keywords that people are looking for and those backlinks. Those three things and other things are, can be done to help you reach that uh, first place in the search of the organics or to be on the Mac pack or be at least closer to that. So if you're interested, please don't hesitate to call Eric. He's got other steps, future steps, and other ideas of things that we can help. Uh, thank you for listening to this video, and have a good night.